Let's record this for YouTube as well. So if you're watching this over on YouTube, what's up, YouTube? Welcome to the Trials of Mana playthrough. This will be sick. And, uh... If you're watching this, don't forget you guys watch me live over at, uh... Twitch.tv slash ProJared live at least five days a week, sometimes more right now. Oh no. Heck, hold on. I can hear the... I don't know why my capture device does this. Sometimes it just does a bunch of, um, like, sound popping in there, and I don't know why. I just have to give it a quick reset, and then it's going to fix itself, just like that. I'm playing the remake version. This is not the SNES original. Even though I love the SNES original. One of, probably like one of the top Super Nintendo games of all time. There we go. I Also, I have not played the demo for this, so I'm going into this pretty dang blind. When the world was shrouded in darkness. Damn, that looks awesome. The goddess of mana drew forth the sword of mana to smite the eight Benavidons? They were called mana beasts. She sealed the horrors inside the eight mana stones, bringing the realm back from the brink. Weak from rebuilding the world. The goddess changed into a tree and fell fast asleep for years. However, the forces of evil sought to free the Benavidons to gain control of the world. The Super Nintendo game has, like, amazing music. They started a terrible war to further their plot and destabilize the kingdoms. Peace was at an end. Oh wow, you can even see like, that's like the exact area. The mana itself began to disappear from the world, and the mana tree to wither. Why do I stream so late? It's 2pm for me. I stream on my schedule, not yours. <laughs> this is like exact recreation. Ah, it's so good. One of my favorite songs is just like the main menu song. Where's Flammy? You mean where's Booskaboo? Oh no, all the other fairies, they can't quite keep up. Tony Bamrick gifting us up to zero wolf rider. All right, hit me with that menu music. Trials of mana. Oh, this is different. Oh, cool! You can switch it to the original? <gasps> That's awesome! Hell yeah. Boron dropping a sub bomb of 10? So this is how the song sounded in the original game. Like, this still sounds awesome! But then, like, I don't know, this remake kind of sounds like it's crushing it.
Oh my god. There's that, uh... I love that old... Adjust the brightness of the left and right images are available are visible. That look good to me. Ooh, hard mode? Well, I ain't no bitch, so. I freed the pirate thanks to Twitch Prime resub. So basically what we you have your different character options. We got uh the fighter, the sorcerer, the monk. The cleric, the thief, that's my boy. And then a sort of, I guess, ranger, druid, uh, I don't know. You choose character? Yeah. Again, whoever you pick as your main character changes who your final boss is. So, I'm playing as Hawkeye. The name's Hawkeye, renowned thief from Navarro. And then we can choose two companions, and again, like, whoever you choose here is whoever you get first. So, whenever I played this originally, my, um, my, my go-to team was the ones I always played with my, uh, with my best friends. Which was, one played as Duran, and the other played as Kevin. I want to bring Rises, though. Is that how you pronounce her name? Ah, oh, she's cute. Pretty much the only one I didn't like playing at all was Charlotte. She annoyed the fuck out of me. I did not like her. Uh, let's get Duran. I'm a soldier from Volsena. The name's Duran. Duran, grab Rice. I am Reese. It Reese. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Reese, got it. Proceed with this party. Yeah, fuck me up. Let's go. Silver mana statue, save your game. Gold mana statue, save your game and restore you. And there's an extra special mana statue somewhere? That's different. Unless you mean the different crystals to class change? I do hope this is going to be way better than Secret of Mana Remake. Oh, damn. That Navarre music. Where there is light, there must also be dark. So the thieves of Navarro what a handsome boy. In the shadows of the world. Also, Hawkeye's best friends is Eagle and Nico. Going in. Get ready. Hell yeah. Oh. Well, there's a dodge button and a jump button? So the treasure's upstairs. I might have to change some of these controls. He's gonna fuck me up. Because normally it's... Wait, is, do I have just a strong attack? I sound surprised at basic controls. Uh, there wasn't a jump button in the original game, nor a dodge button. It's my money. <laughs> my. 
It's mine now, bitch. Taking candy from a baby. Ah, a thief. No, not my money. <sighs> you had to make this complicated. Now that I have your undivided attention, let me give you some advice. You've made a killing swindling the people living hand to mouth in this town. Yeah, greedy merchant. Now's your chance to put yourself in their shoes. Maybe you'll think twice about your dirty business practices now that you're the one who's lost all his money, huh? You should thank me, really. That's rich, coming from a common thief. Look at Zangief chest hair. <laughs> Touche. But something tells me you'll get over it. Farewell. Try breaking a sweat with an honest day's work for a change. <laughs> Hawkeye's hot, dude. They made Nico super cute. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Bring the music up. Thieves were known to sweep through towns, stealing ill-gotten goods from the undeserving rich. While their leader, Flamecon, held down the remote desert fortress in the sand dunes. I am liking the music so far. <laughs> A little bit of texture pop in there, that's okay. It happens. from the raid, sir. Well done. Oh, you haven't heard. Oh my Lord, god. Forgive me. King Flamecon has disbanded the Thieves Guild and declared Navarre an independent nation. Under well, see y'all over on Mixer. We're wasting away in this forsaken desert. Mana power is shifting and threatening our place in the world, our people's resources. Like the waters of the oasis are drying up. Apparently, this game's like, what if Isabel just had like giant anime titties and they're hanging out going, the Navarre Nation? Now, His Majesty has a meeting to attend, so you just sit tight. All right. They mm. sure sexed her up. Oh, Hawkeye. When did you get back? I is something wrong? What is Flamecon thinking? He's never been ashamed of our thievery before. How can we give up our entire livelihood, our creed? And for what? <sighs> what is going on? This is Hawkeye's girlfriend, Jessica. And there's something strange about that, Isabella. I know she saved the Lord's life when he was stranded in the desert, but making her second in command? What's her ankle? I'm sure my father has the people's interests at heart, Hawkeye. If the wells we all depend on go dry, we can't live here forever. So... <sighs> but a king? Flamecon hates monarchies. So now we're going to bleed the citizens of our new nation dry to fill the king's pockets just like our enemies do? How will we be any different from them? 
Stop insulting my father. Oh, what? Did you want to play the part of the pretty little princess, Jessica? Stop! Yeah, I kind of deserve that one. <laughs> Exploring a barrel. Um, pick up. Poor Lucra! They still call it Lucra, hell yeah! <laughs> Dude, that sounds awesome. The chanting music? I... So they made... They made X special attack? I might have to... Kind of, might need to switch those around. Is there a, um... Controls option? Yeah, they have a... Power attack? Not used to that. See, in the original game, you just had your basic attack, and then you could press B to do your special attack after you built up enough hits. Which is why I was considering changing that. Just so it's closer to what I know, make an X the jump button. Or I could just get used to it. I don't know. I'll try it out a little bit first and see if I need to change it or not. Hello. A whole army of female guards, huh? Sounds like a nice way to go. They can arrest me anytime. You're talking about the Amazons, don't... The Amazons guard Laurent. They're a special battalion of female soldiers, and you can bet they're strong. Spring Magoo with 200 bits. Thank you so much. Sir Crow 92 is rich by Marisa. We don't see you out here very often. What's the occasion? I'm gonna need to, s I need to speed up that text. All right, guess there's only two options. Will you take me on a raid sometimes? Everyone says you're the best. I am. Thank you. I'm glad you noticed. I don't know how much platforming this game's gonna have. Yep. There's the save statue. Tight. DLY515, thanks for Twitch Prime sub. Save slot two, baby! Are these are all the important people I need to talk to? Did you say something mean to Jessica? You better not have. Jessica! No? Okay. Looks like all the stars on the map are objectives. Hmm, treasure. There was a hidden treasure in the original game that you can get in Navarro? Stardust Herb! Sick. That's cool. Damn. The music's been great. I'm digging it. Whee. Nope. Way more treasure chests in here than there were before. Chocolate? Damn, they're just passing these out. King Flamicon hasn't been his of himself lately. I guess he was worried about forming a nation. It all makes sense now. Where's Eagle? Yeah, because there's only a treasure. So you can like see slash get to in like a kind of outdoor cavern area. 
have no idea if they still have it. Depends if they moved it. Okay. Yeah, there it is. That's the one. It's not even that great of a treasure. But I'm not gonna not get treasure. My problem with that one is I always remember it being just slightly confusing to get to. So I don't think it's this area. I think you have to go up more. Oh, there's a thing over here. Hell yeah, four dollars. Got it. Chocolate. I should have just tried to see if I could jump down. Oh, whatever. Confused, thanks for gifting a sub to Angry Beard Blaze. <laughs> oh, I can't jump down? Bummer. Oh, that's really handy. So they have like quick slots in the lower right. Which seems way better than um, having to constantly pull up a ring menu. The door is shut. I know. Open it. Alright. But Ah oh, fuck. That's a different treasure. How do I get to that one? I I know it's not even that worthwhile. <laughs> Nothing to report. Good, I'm glad. Let me through. No. Damn it. make that jump, though. <laughs> fuck. Ah, oh, fuck it. Again. I know I was not that exciting. Oh, what's up, Nico? Oh, no, no, no. I'm not meant for fighting, and my wars make my whiskers stand on end. Brother, what do we do, meow? A lot of just kind of run around and talk to people at the start. It's not so much three main storylines. There's one main storyline to go with every character's individual story, and there's three final bosses. Okay, sir. Eagle wanted to talk to you. Go to Eagle's room. This guy just reminded me of Edgar from Final Fantasy VI. Hawkeye, there's something bothering me. By now, I'm sure you've heard about the invasion of Laurent. Have you noticed anything strange about my father lately? That's exactly what sister. I thought. We two have grown up together here in the fortress, so I knew you must have noticed it as well. I knew it. 
He hasn't truly been himself since he went missing in the dunes last month. Fortunately, that newcomer Isabella found him before he... But I swear, nothing has been the same since. He does look like Edgar, right? My hunch is correct. Isabella may be at the root of the problem. But no more. I will expose her for the evildoer she is. It's like Edgar, but he looks like he's 17. I would play a Final Fantasy VI game if it looked like this. Don't rush on ahead. Something's got me on edge. I better go after him. Edgar, Edgar, Eagle, you forgot your candy. Eagle, Eagle, you forgot your candy. Supposed to be a clan of ninjas. Why are you dressed like a knight? Understood. Do pass on my message. Hold, fiend. We have you now. Whom have you snuck into the fortress? And what have you done to my father? We'll continue when pests are taken care of. I'll leave them to you. Wow. Their boobs are out of control. Oh, you children will find out there are things better left unseen in the world. But no matter. I will have you forget my little secret. Just like Flame Con. Stop manipulating my father! I'll throw you out of this fortress myself! <laughs> what an innocent babe. It hurts. Eagle, uh, what's wrong? Things get screwy right away. Uh, you have to run, Hawkeye. Uh, must eliminate. Must be destroyed. No, this isn't you, Eagle. Fight it. Oh dear. He can't hear you now. What will you do? Attack your friend or perish on his blade? Oh, Did he have like a big ass sword normally? So this is like your introduction to combat when you play Hawk Hawkeye's story. The very first person you have to fight is your best friend. Brother to your girlfriend. Son of the king. Soby Blood, thanks that resub. Also Chrono Christanthos. Gym Room. Defeat. Kill. Hawkeye! <laughs> Eagle, stop this! I don't want to fight you! I'm being a shell of him. Do I have to listen to guys beat the shit out of them? Shot! So you can actually see his, uh... Oh, so it drops a little percent crystal so I can do my special attacks? Ow. Oh, wow, that built a lot. Okay. So normally it's B button, but now it's... Hold L, press Y. Poison dagger! That's like the exact same attack as it was originally. It wasn't called Poison Dagger, it was just like a multi-slash. Eagle! Stay with me! Locke has to fight Edgar. Uh, Hawkeye, you... You did... The right thing. Huh. Still alive, I see. Oh. Allow me to fix that. Oh, God. In the original translations... 
Hawkeye just hit him with the flat sides of his blade, just smacking him to knock him unconscious rather than Eagle. stabbing him. Eagle, no. uh, you, you did this to Eagle. You fell. <laughs> I'm done playing, child. Someone, come quick. The man's a murderer. What's the problem? Oh no. His old friends. No. Bill. Not Eagle. What was his other, other guy friend's name? How could you? Don't move. There's something silly. It was like Bill and uh Lance? Ben? Bill and Ben, that's what it was, thank you. No! It wasn't me! I would never Out. Murder is no laughing matter. Your execution date is being decided. I suggest you reflect on your crimes while you wait. You know she's evil because her eyeballs are like the thin slit cat eyes. Evil. <laughs> oh, best be quiet, dear. If you tell anyone, your friend Jessica's life is forfeit. What have you done to her? Oh, I just gave her a cursed little present, if you will. If you step out of line, you may not like the consequences. I don't know if the game will go into it, but basically she gave Jessica a cursed necklace that she cannot take off. And if Hawkeye tries to tell anyone the truth, the necklace will then choke Jessica to death. Let me out! Someone there? Anyone? Jessica. My brother. Equal. He. They're saying you did it. But that can't be. No one was closer to my brother than you. See, now you can see you're actually wearing the necklace. So tell me, who killed my brother? I... Talk, and her life is forfeit. Please, tell me, who was it? <laughs> Hawkeye! Why won't you say anything? No. It couldn't be. But you and Eagle? Jessica. I like Hawkeye's prologue. I thought his is one of the best. Dead. Credits. I believe Mew. I know Mew have framed. <laughs> Come on. We need to get away from here as soon as possible. Ah, uh, uh, quick, through this hole. Thanks, Niccolo. Isabella will pay. I can't stick around to fall and escape the prison. Wait, hold on. One of the best songs in the game is coming up. As I'm, if as Hawkeye makes his escape. Her, as and Mew mentioned, I think it's the legendary Choker of Death. If the stories are true, once Mew put it on, Mew can never take it off. And if Isabella dies, Jessica will die with her. Oh yeah, that's fucked but up too. The priest of light in Holy City Wendell might have some leads. Mew should leave Navarro and find the priest. <laughs> I'll take care of things here. What? Okay. I trust you, Niccolo. 
Take care of Jessica while I'm gone. Hey, you take care of me yourself. Don't worry, I'll look after Jessica. Huh? Did it still do the escape? The prisoner is loose. Here Stop it is. In. Best song in the game. Wait, no, this isn't the right song. Ow, oh, they changed it. It's supposed to be nuclear fusion. Okay, so they actually have uh, different combos you can do. Four experience? Experience bonus? What you want? Damn, you should be like impossible to level up Hawkeye before you leave this area. This kid just handing out experience. Level up to increase your hit points and stats like your strength. Oops. Item menu. Got it. This is one of the coolest things about the original games that when you level up, you get stat points. And you actually get to choose where you want your points to go to change your stats. Only now they give you a bunch of new moves and stuff? That's cool! So instead of just being raw strength, is like strength plus five, sturdy, ward off, interception. Oh, this is all cool. This is new. Retain. Okay, but so Hawkeye's highest stat is his luck. Harder for enemies to target. Item drop rate increased by five percent. Kind of want that. I can put two points in this right away, because normally you get two points, you can level up two stats one like once. I could just go up to plus five strength to get the uh Nah, I want lucky find. I'm going straight for items. You must equip learned abilities to use them? Also new. Oh damn! Okay. Oh, you can actually change your costumes after you do your class change. You can choose your outfit. That's very nice. One of the things I did want to change on the controls was that it's hold L to activate your special attacks. I think I'd rather that be R. Can I not change those individually? Damn. That sucks. <laughs> Alright. Hey, Retro Phoenix. Thanks for the bits and the Twitch Prime. Also, Fishy Foot, Dirt, Dirt Todd. Sorry, where was I going? Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is the Second Tetsu 3 remake. Done. Plus 10% experience defeated without taking damage. Not get fucked, I guess. Tree Harder also resubbing. This is more of what you wanted from the original Secret of Mana remake. Uh, it's still pretty early on, so I haven't quite decided yet. It seems much more promising so far. Alright, sorry, why button is dodge? Oh, 
I like how they have the exact same chime from when the battle is over as it did in the original. Yep. Yeah! Oh, a cup of wishes? That's super worth it. A cup of wishes is a phoenix down. And six dollars. Hell yeah. Blue Jay with 100 bits. How do I like it so far? I mean, I'm what? 40 minutes into it, so it's so hard to say. It seems like, uh... I wish they didn't change his escape song there. His escape music originally was awesome. Eagle. Don't, don't worry. I swear on my life that I won't let anything happen to Jessica. I have to leave now, but... I will be back to avenge your death, dearest friend. And I will save your sister. Jessica, you have to stay safe until I return. Please be safe. What did I like about the Secret of Mana remake? It didn't control the best. Okay. Pained by the loss of his dear friend, set off for Wendell to find a way to lift Jessica's curse. Are they still gonna do the opening text crawl or credit scroll here? Hell yeah! Uh, also, in the original or the Secret of Mana remake, the music was either like kind of good or just like not quite there. They also made the Secret of Mana remake way too easy. Yeah, just overall didn't did not like it as much. I also like this art style more. It seems like they put a little more effort into it. Like, the Secret of Mana remake, they were much more, um... Polygonal. This one's single player only, which is probably the dumbest thing they could have done. Like, some online play would have been amazing. I did not play the demo, no. Chad belongs to Ferolia. Don't resist, and we may spare you. The Rolian forces have taken the town and closed the docks. Now my ship's stuck in the harbor until who knows when. A beastman invasion. Well, no one said this was gonna be easy. Taking a lock is child's play for a thief like me, but not with guards swarming the area. Ferolian forces have taken the town and closed the docks. Now my ship's stuck. Shit! <laughs> Rockmonger, Fuzz God, Corals think that's all those Twitch Primes. Yeah, so far the music's been awesome. It feels like they basically try to use more instruments to make music that's more faithful to the original. Rather than trying to update it with a new feel and sound. You know what I mean? Because I feel like the original Secret Man, they tried to update it, and it just did not sound as good. What's up, Duran? 
Even if weapon shop doesn't sell weapons. <laughs> this is a joke. I ain't laughing. I wish I could have Come such on, abs I could wear midriffs all the time. For a fight. Uh, not sure if I can beat them all on my own. Even if I had more weapons. Oh, a headache. Oh, hell yeah! These dudes still rock out and just dance all the time? He's just happy to be working. We can all only aspire to be shopkeep guy. Argue with the resub, pal for the door. Thank you, guys. I guess another thing that was kind of working against the Secret of Mana remake is that... Let's be honest, Secret of Mana isn't that amazing of a game, especially compared to Saiken Zetsu 3. Oh, they still have a seed box? Damn. So yeah, even though I didn't pick them, you still meet the other characters throughout this throughout the game. Hey! What is wrong with you? Could you give a girl some peace and quiet? Back off! <laughs> That's the second time I've been slapped. You can't get anything past me. Hmm. Also, in the original game, when you actually use the inn, they got under the covers, and um, they actually like changed into their pajamas or underwear. Or if you, Angela, she was naked. And then if you emulated it and then removed the the sprite layer of the beds, it just showed their sleeping sprites. And you could see them naked. Look, when I was 12, that was awesome. Chocolate! Sir WJV and Ninja Meatloaf, thank you guys both for resubscribing. Okay, so sometimes the camera does pull itself back. I kind of wish it had this view rather than the behind the back view as much, but this is nice. See now, in the remake, when you first meet up with Angela in the inn like that, she actually stands up and is naked and shows her boobs and everything, but they change the cutscene if there's someone in chat that's horny. Welcome. Lots of wares to browse. <laughs> Come again. Didn't need any of that. What's up, Kevin? <laughs> Scared me. Do you still talk like an idiot? Shh, shh. Don't tell them I'm here, okay? Can't be found out. I am one of them, but not with them. Can't let them see me. Don't tell. Please? Ah, uh, okay. I think he talks a little bit more normal now. Because normally, whenever you talk to Kevin, he talks like someone with an intelligence score, like, five. Dude, I a hundred bits. Thank you so much. I am going to take my time with this and explore around a lot. Kiot! 
<laughs> Tornado Claw! <laughs> oh, sorry. Drill Claw! Yeah! Also, unlike the original Secret of Mana, you can buy weapons and armor throughout the game instead of just having the eight mana weapons that you switch between. is missing, and I must find him as soon as possible. Have you perchance seen a little lost boy around here? No. I see. Sorry. Thank you, anyway. What if I say yes? during the day, but at night, they transform into animals. Don't leave the house after dark. You hear? Oh, really? Hey, if you're trying to leave the city, night is actually best. Once the beastmen transform, they lose their better judgment. The whole lot of them tend to get together and brawl amongst themselves until dawn. It's easier to sneak out of the city then. Good luck. All right, well, I guess in this game, just gotta spell it out for you. Perhaps someone can keep me company at the tavern until nightfall to uh, avoid these guards. On second thought, maybe it'd be better to rest at the end just in case. I've tried Prime. Thank you. I hope this is one of the better Secret of Mana remake. I mean, so far it seems like it is, but again, like. I always try to keep in mind, like, Psych and Tetsu 3 was just such a better game than the original Secret of Mana. Looking for a place to rest? No charge! I'm just happy to dance! Ah, be real, Chad. Most of you would still fuck the beast men. You st still sleeping? Did it have four player co op? The original game had two player co op. Not four. Original Secret Man had three. This one had two. Now's your chance to get out of here. It sure is. Later, nerds. How to escape battles? Get past the yellow line. If the boundary is red, you cannot escape the battle. Rabbites! Rabbites are adorable. It's the Booskaboo landing zone. It's actually kind of cool that it's just kind of one big seamless world. Because before, it was much like Secret of Mana, where each like area was like uh, like individual screens that you would transition between. But now it's just like one big 
This is one big open world. That's neat. I'm getting so freaking rich, dude. Clone Trooper Kev with 34 months. Thank you so much. Because it's nighttime, the rabbits are sleeping. Oh, what's up, Kazer Leon? Good to see you again. Hope you've been well. Just another couple of wishes there? I feel like they're just kind of passing those out. At least, you know, compared to how it was. Money. Oh, hell yeah. So, this game does have a day night system that kind of happens naturally, but I believe, for the opening section of the game uh, until a very specific event. Uh, that won't start yet. Whoa! Assassinate! So they actually make them flying, so you have to jump up at them. Yeah, I'm playing the Switch version. For you, Luca? I am playing on hard mode, by the way. I don't know if I uh, stated that earlier. Just luck, light. Pretty subbing. So interestingly, if you start to charge up a strong attack, they wake up and hear you. So I'm trying to get to the next town. Lakeside Town Astoria. Yeah, that's exactly where I want to go. Oops. Whoa, you can dodge roll midair. Hit! <laughs> Oh, this is a least separate section for later. Fifty lucra. An item seed. Mush booms. Oh no. Another save point here? They must have added way more save points before. Because for a while, those were like a little more sparingly. Nah. I want to go south. Yeah, I do. Oh, there's a lock on up. Okay. Oh. I think I hate the lock-on. Yeah, I think I hate the lock-on. Got both you bitches! Magic rope!
Oh, uh, do I I have to try to go through the cave first? That's right. So I'm still trying to make my way to Holy City Wendell. Wendell. Oh, okay, camera. Guess we're doing this. Ah! <laughs> An invisible force blocking the way. Fantastic. The magic barrier is in the way. These lockpicks are useless then. Yes, I should look elsewhere. All right. I love the little load screen of the Mush Boom and Rabbite running together. God, I feel like they nailed the music. Leave their money laying around. You know how hard it was to get money in the original? I'm rich bitch. What's <laughs> up, uh, dude? Oh, no, you're asleep. I can't buy from him. Dicks. I'm saving my skill point for when I got one more. Huh. Huh. Sorry, sir. Sorry. Welcome. Lots of wares to browse. Ah, oh, hell yeah. Oh, good choice. I have an eye for quality. Would you like my old flint knife? <laughs> Come again. Does it actually change my weapons? Ah, oh, they do! Sick! Can I glamour these as well so I always, they can always look how I want them to look? I guess it's kind of nice that they put all the stars here so you know you're supposed to, who you're supposed to talk to. Because in the original game, you just, like, talked to people until you found the person you're supposed to to start the next event. Oh, never else quite far from here, young man. The thieves you have been overcalling. Now I hear they steal from the rich and poor alike. Not to mention the raids! What do they need so much military power for, huh? I just don't understand. You know the gold and silver mana statues? Yeah, I do. I paid attention to the tutorial. Hello, sir. Did no you see something over the lake? I saw it. A strange light was floating over the lake. Maybe it'll appear tonight, too. You remember hitting the magic wall and getting lost? What? That was the, uh, it becoming morning Salamando Day. They also make it so that, depending on the day of the week, actually adjusts the different elements' power. So it's Salamando Day, which means fire is now stronger. Yeah, because before you had, like, talked to that guy down on the beach who, who says, I saw something over the lake! Curses! I managed to get away from Jad, but now I'm stuck here because of the barrier. I'll now never get home to Wendell. Take down the barrier? Uh, hey, bud, if you figure it out, let me know. Gonna spend the night here, I guess. You can spend the night here, too! Da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da
Oh, sick. Is that more money? Sure is. Yeah, it's to be able to get to the Cascade Cavern. Okay, he's the other side of the lake. <laughs> Can't do that anymore now. Orangey Chu and Leesky, thank you guys both for Twitch Prime resubs. Ah, oh, this is for later. Getting out of myself. But I do want this money. Another item seed? Dang. Jenna Opal, also resubbing. Thanks for streaming. Thanks for watching. Appreciate you guys being here. So as you're playing the game, you find these item seeds. And you plant the item seeds at the plant box. At the uh, inn. And these are just basic item seeds. I'm probably gonna get like candies, chocolates, maybe a couple wishes. Oh, I can plant more than one at a time? Thank fucking god. This used to take forever in the original game. Pot oil, a gnome icon, Sahagan chip, a couple wishes. Hey, a couple wishes. Why does the box level up? Okay. A lot of the items I just got are, um... They're like, a, they're like attack items. Like the Sahagan chip deals damage. Put oil recovers all the allies' hit points. Hell yeah. Earth damage. Boosts ally magic attack and defense. This guy isn't dancing. Welcome. Rest until evening. Chase the strange light! Holy shit! My eyes are playing tricks on me! You saw a light too, didn't you? Well, be. Or well, maybe we're all dying at the same t time as I am. I guess I'm going towards the light. You too, kid! Alright! Wow, that was a strange light. Now I'm curious. It might be something valuable. <laughs> I should check it out. What if it's money? Better go! Niccolo thinks of Hawkeye as his trusted friend and brother in arms. Though most catfolk become traveling merchants, Niccolo chose to join the thieves in Navarro instead. <laughs> uh, flying money! Come back! There it goes! I want that money! Cut, 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 cut! Oh, these guys are level three now. Better not fuck around. Oh, yeah, I crushed it. Come back, flying money. Do they not have... Everyone used to have unique treasure opening animations. Like, um, Hawkeye would do, like, this... Like, this little, like, twirl... Um like hand gesture thing to make it open. Kevin would just like kick the shit out of it to open it. 
not, I don't know if they had that in this game at all. Uh, Kier just kind of like snaps his finger at it. Whoops. Pick it up. Ten dollars. Come here. Kyaw! Come back! Money, come back! Damn, doing crits like you wouldn't believe. Another item seed. I guess I should be more excited for those because they might be more important. Oh, this sure is a strange looking statue. Burp, 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 burp. <laughs> they have like little healing pots around. Oh no, you gave uh, a voice of a full-grown woman. Oh, give me a little cutie. Uh, uh, I... Uh, I'm alright. Oh. Who... Who are you? Wait a second. I'm from Navarre. You're not my me. I from the Astoria Inn. You can call me Hawkeye. I see. Oh, I have no other option. So I suppose you'll do. Hold on. Hmm? What? Oh, never mind. I'll tell you later. Please. I need you to take me to the Priest of Light and Wendell. I can't fly any further on my own. That's actually where I'm headed anyway. But there's a barrier around the cavern. We're stuck here until further notice, I'm afraid. I can get us through the barrier. But we need to hurry. Something has happened to the Sanctuary of Mana. The Sanctuary of Mana? Wait. Whoop. I hope that wasn't anything important. What on earth? That came from Astoria. Sorry, I, I gotta go back. We need to get going. Let me rest inside you for a bit. You won't see me, but don't worry. I'm still here. What? Whoa! Wait, what? Don't delay. We must see to Astoria. Uh, she's talking in my head. That is the weirdest feeling. It's just called Twitch chat, Hurry. Hawkeye. Don't... You'll get used to it. Okay, okay, I'm on it. You take fairy with you. So, why are you heading to Wendell? There's oh, a small matter of a cursed choker that I need to figure out how to remove. Extra dialogue. Oh, I see you have. Wait, one sec. Shut up. You had an easy time yourself. Gotta get back to town.
Ah, oh, heck. Gather around, children. Wait, did he speak of the Choker? Well, he can speak of the Choker, he just can't talk about who actually killed Eagle. It's a fine line. Or more so, like, you can't tell Jessica the truth or something along those lines. Whatever. This end, uh, thank you for the 100 bits. Do I think the Secret of Mana remake would have been better or more popular if it had been more like this? I mean, yeah, if the Secret of Mana remake was just better, it would have been better. Ah, shit! You leave for like two minutes. What happened here? Where is everyone? This looks like the work of Beastmen. What? Cowards! There is no time to waste. We have to get to the Priest of Light as soon as possible. <sighs> Wendell is in danger. So much death. Someone left their money laying around. Hold on. Sick. I can't believe there's so much destruction. Is that more money? Hold on. Hell yeah. This is the worst thing I've ever seen. I just... I'm so distraught. Hold on. There might be money over there. Hell yeah. It's so awful. My god, so many innocent lives lost, such careless just- is that money? Hold on. I am looting the town. Like, not even being shy about it. So many cup of wishes. They cost like 350 each. So getting these now is saving me so much cash. I mean, I guess I could just take it. I don't think there's anyone here who's going to miss it. Do luck stats dictate what items you get? Um, $100. It used to dictate um, your crit chance and your chance of getting rare item drops later in the game. Um, I don't think, I don't think this game has raw stats like it used to. It just seems more like you build them up to get skill points or skills that you equip. I think I'm done looting. Learn abilities. Yeah, they did just remove the dexterity stat completely. I did notice that. And honestly, it completely threw me off because there used to be six stats. One of them was dexterity, and there's like no more, I guess. So that made me sad. Oh damn, I'm actually quite a bit away from leveling up still. All right. What's up, Duran? Wanna hang out? I like your abs. Can I touch them? Way to a Wendell, bit? But there's something blocking off Cascade Cavern. Got some freeze skips there. Oh, funny story. Huh? You've 
Got a fairy that can help? Oh, that's what the light over the forest was. <laughs> Sounds like things are getting interesting around here. So, uh, what's your business in Wendell? Oh, I see. Sounds like uh, you had her rough. Me? Oh, I'm Durant, a soldier from Volsena. Can I eat sushi off your body, please? You can experience the previous journey of your new companion, Duran. Play through their past? Oh! That's cool! So originally in the game, they just did like a, um... They just did a, uh, like, kind of montage flashback scene to kind of show you what happened in the story. But now you can play it! And that's neat. Um... I don't know if I'm gonna do that, because... That was like 40 minutes just for Hawkeyes. And I already know the story. So. Not long ago when I was doing my usual go oh. around. Oh! Or if you say no, it just shows you. This is Durant's Castle theme. Also, a great song. And I put up as much of a fight as I could, but. There was no match for his magic powers. Yeah, he just gets rocked by fireballs. I'm from a family of swordmasters. I always trusted him. Brute strength. That cursed magic chewed me up and spat me out. Now I don't know what to do. Lost every last bit of confidence. But <laughs> he ain't seen the last of me. I'll show him. I'll show everyone that the way of the sword can be just as powerful as magic. Just like my dad always told me. Well, there's no way I can defeat that cursed wizard right now, though. That's why His Majesty the King let me travel to Holy City Wendell to learn how to switch my class. I'll find that wizard and make him pay. Mark my words. Huh. In any case, I'm on my way to Wendell too, so... Guess that makes us travel companions, huh? Yeah! <laughs> Even does like the companion join thing. That's so neat. Can I still. Come on. Oh, hell yeah! So you can still switch between them. Good! Damn, his like range of attack is so much bigger than Hawkeye's. Watch. Come on. Versus. That's cool. I actually like Duran's story because I feel like it's almost almost typically the opposite when it comes to swordsmen. It's always like, all you ever understand is brute strength. Don't you understand that smartness and magic can be more powerful? Almost kind of like diminishing that. Whereas Duran's like, magic beat me, but I can show everyone that like swordplay can be just as strong as magic. And I got slapped in the face again. Thank you. Thanks, Fairy. Appreciate it. You knew that was there. You knew that was there. Calm Charles, the Twitch Prime resub, and Web Tangler resubbing. Without going to have to wait two hours of waiting for USPS to deliver the game. My actual, my physical copy of the game isn't showing up until Tuesday. So I just downloaded it. I sure have been slapped in the face a lot. Dude, they're killing this music. This is amazing. Wow, you're pretty confident for a party of one. I'm a soldier from Voltaina myself. Don't want to brag, but I'm pretty good with a sword. Uh, the monsters around here aren't so tough. Seems this is a good travel arrangement for all of us. Effie Vanguard like gifting a sub to Eddie Haru. Oh, Jadale's in the chat. Jadale's one of the guys I had uh, I played this game with originally, which is why I have Duran here because Duran was his favorite. Speaking of Jadale, what do you think? Dark path or light path for Duran? 
shield or no? Shield or two-handed sword? Kevin was Josh's favorite? Sure was! Whoa, what's up, AoE? You always like shield boy? I kinda like that too. You must have taken out all the enemies nearby. Well, because before when I had the party of Hawkeye, Duran, and Kevin, like Kevin it was definitely the ass beater. So having another like heavy damage dealer just kinda seemed like overkill. Hello? Two candies! Also, Duran is level 4. This is bullshit. Don't you hate it when a new party member joins your team and they're higher level than you are? Three more hits. Get him. <laughs> oh, look at that! Durant already doing more as a party member than anyone in the Final Fantasy VII Remake ever did. Oh. Limited time. Daylight, dry out day. Time to work together, everyone! Hold on. Uh, what was that? Come on. There we go. <laughs> Do the days do anything? Yeah. Um, depending on the day of the week, magic differs. That's disappointing. So on Salamander Day, Salamander's magic is more powerful, whereas Undyne's is weaker. Oh, cool! He does hit it with his sword. Okay, so they do have different um, treasure chest opening animations still. That's nice. Was that a little spike towards Final Fantasy VII Remake? It was a little frustration towards Final Fantasy VII Remake. That's because in Final Fantasy VII Remake, they want you to be commanding them, not doing their own thing. I would rather they actually just attack instead of standing around guarding against nothing 80% of the time. It wasn't great. Hell yeah. I finally got my skill points. Lucky find, baby. Boom. Item drop rate increased by 5%. You're welcome. So I guess right now I've got two skill slots. Until I like, level up or class change? I don't know. Oh, let's get, um. The ransom training. He learns counter? Attack increases by 10% for 30 seconds when receiving damage. That's cool. Break armor. Normal attack's better at breaking armor by 50%. Stamina. Hit points. Defense up while charging. Base stamina. Quick heal. Status effect time shortened by 30%. Oh, like poison and stuff. Gotcha. Retain. Okay, so buff increased by 100%. Add 10% CS gauge when receiving damage. He has lucky break. Provoke. Oh, I actually can make him into a tank. Whereas Hawkeye gets under luck. Enigma, so he becomes harder to target. On Duran, you can increase his luck to make him an actual target. That's super cool. Holy shit! 
That's so cool! That just wasn't a thing in the original game. So they actually all have different abilities under the things. Oh no! Uh-oh! This game might rule! Actually, like I- like I- I would even consider giving him intelligence points just cause like these buffs are also really good? Not as crazy about the spirit boosts. What I want here? Hold on. Strategy? Oh, you can actually change what they do! Prioritize nearby, range enemies, same enemies, other enemies that I'm not attacking, or weaken enemies? No recovery, focus on attacking, balance, focus on healing, only heal. Oh, fucking... This is good shit! This is what I want! I love it. Luck, stamina, intelligence, strength. For Duran? I think I'm, I might focus Duran being a little more... damage focused for now. Stats can affect moves. Intelli intellect set affects magic, spirit affects healing. High luck, I'm gonna use the time with projectiles and traps. Oh, I hope they bring back the uh, the trap wheel when you open chests. Because that was awesome. Once a character learns his ability, equip it. Oh. Oh, this is what I'm looking for. Gear and stats. Let's see. Yeah, so right now, I have a... Alright, I'm gonna do some science. Duran's current attack is 15. If I train him and give him a, just a single point of strength. Just one. And then I go back to his stats. Strength is still... Attack is still 15. Okay. So it seems like he actually does need to get up to six points to increase his overall damage. Not nah, fuck it. Here. All skill points. Let's put that all in there. Here's a chain ability, so now both Duran and Hawkeye are better at breaking armor. See, I can also give him lucky finds so that he has a better chance of finding items. But we'll stick with that for now. I guess I could take off... I could take off Enigma, because who cares? It's early enough. Damn. Alright, so I just pumped him full of strength, and his attack is still 15. And his raw strength is still 11. Okay, yeah. So unlike the original game, you're not spending... You're not, like, spending points to strictly raise that stack. Because before, it was literally like, he had 11 as strength, put a point of strength, he now has 12 strength. Uh, so now it's just more pure skill points, which is still cool. Because as you give them skill points, you can still raise their raw stats. I gotcha. Okay. And right now, I only have higher attack than Durant because I was able to buy a weapon. Durant didn't. But once he gets two more skill points, like, he's gonna get five strength. Where if I put two skill strength skill points on myself, I immediately get five strength? Dude, this rules. Come on. I'll try him out a little bit more though. Gotta see his other attacks. Like this. I'll take points. Shut! <laughs> 
Oh, there. 20? Holy shit. Come here. Come here. Damn it. Like me at my best. Okay, so when your allies use their special attacks, it doesn't do like the crazy okay. Leave uh, it to me. animation for them. God damn, why isn't this game co op? <sighs> oh, this would have been so cool. It's so good. If just even just the two player mode, I would have accepted just the two player mode. Online only? Fine. Man, it would have been amazing. Like, I would, I would co op the, the shit the out of this game. Out. Especially, like, the way to have skill points so each player can make their builds how they want. Like, that's so good. Co op seems hard with the camera perspective. That's why you, you need to play it online and just have a. Uh, each person have their own copy so they have their own camera angle. Whoops, didn't mean that way. Also, even though my attack is higher than Duran's, uh, he definitely seems to hit harder. Like, I did a strong attack for 15. He's strong attacks for 20 right now. Mushroom was part of the head to attack. Well, they did before. Yeah, Hawkeye hits faster. In the original game, Hawkeye could attack faster, so he'd build his special meter quicker, which was great. Help me! Ooh, ooh. through these monster dens alone. Got it. So there's a reason I never liked playing as her. I'll let you try to discern why. I grew up with no parents, but there was one priest in Wendo that was always nice to me. He was kind and helpful. Well, what the he fuck? Care of me. My grandpa asked Heath to go to Astoria to look into something for the temple. But I got a really, really bad feeling about it. Has anyone ever used her as a main character? I don't know. I didn't want anything to happen to Heath. So I followed him in secret and didn't tell grandpa when but I she, left. She is like the best healer in the game, though. Oh my god, the springy boys are still here. By a horrible twist of fate. There's the jester. A creepy looking man took Heath away. Why would I finally found him? One again? of the other final bosses. It's like someone reprogrammed her keyboard so that anytime they press R, it's instead a W. I got a widow lost on the way. And fell down. <laughs> if you hadn't been there, it would have been good night, Charlotte. <laughs> that was close. <sighs> she still has like, well. Way too adult of a voice. To to see the priest of light anyway. You can follow along for now, I guess. Come on. Oh, you want to see Grandpa? Why didn't you say so? You didn't know it, but you helped your chances. I'm actually the granddaughter of the priest of light. But you know, Wendell isn't far from here. You might need my help getting there. 
but I don't need your help getting home. Take care that you don't get lost. Bye bye. So normally, if you actually had Charlotte as one of your party members, this is where she would join. That's a girl who knows what she wants. If anyone talks like that in the chat, you will be banned. Until then, uh, Pro J weebs in the chat. Ooh woo! Oh, that's cool. They actually shoot like the range attacks. We must have taken out all the enemies nearby. God damn it, chat! Stop it! I swear to God. Let's see. I'll have this recording go until I get to the first boss. Ha ha! That's a good combo. If I do the light attack and uh, the air first. Look at it! Way to dodge out of the way, Duran, instead of just standing there like an idiot. Can we just observe this for a second? Get him! Oh, almost. Oh, so it does not split to the party when you open those, so you should switch to the whatever party member you want to get healed to open up the green jars. I, wish you'd never that I like how you can interrupt their attacks as well. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, alright. Okay, so the yellow ones are money pots. Your mind is blown that those are helmets, not the goblins' actual heads? That's how it always was. It was like a weird, like, leather mask thing they had. MO addicted to 100 bits. Kyoki Hono, thanks to the Twitch Prime resub earlier. Zafarian with 200 bits, thank you. Glad you guys are all having a good time. Thanks for being here. Charlotte uses nunchuck. Charlotte uses like a flail. Am I um I thought the the gem beast was in there. Was I mistaken? It's a bit later. Oh. Oh, hell yeah! They're still here, baby! Hit me! Yeah! Oh, that's not the super launcher one. Oh. I have so many cups of wishes. Again, this music's awesome. when you go back through the jewel eater. Trials of Mana uh, was immediately Fine, after Secret of Mana. Hopefully his eminence knows how to lift curses. Thank you so much for taking me here. Hurry, we need to request an audience with his eminence. Yeah, hold on, there's armor shops. Hell yeah, brother! <laughs> Welcome. Lots of wares to browse. Stiff leathers and fatigues? How much money do I have? Oh, plenty. Damn. Duran has such oh, better armor than me. Choice. This is good quality. Oh, 
Good choice. Oh, looks useful. Good choice. <laughs> Come again. You have heard of the Priest of Light, of course. You must seek his wisdom after coming such a long way. Are you here to see the Priest of Light? The temple is down beyond the square. Is it after in universe? The mana games aren't really that connected. So you don't really need to play Secret of Mana to know the plot of this one. You can hear tremors in the ground deep in Cascade Cavern. Oh, what was that could be? Beastmen have made it to Astoria? Whatever shall we do? Ooh, treasure. Sick. <laughs> yeah, I got weapons. Come on up, Sonny. So I already got the dagger. I can give the iron sword to Duran, and then his attacks just higher. Looks good. <laughs> Come again. Ooh, what is that? I just pressed X to open the menu. Oh hell yeah! Sword's looking better, my dude. I kind of want to use the inn on account that we're actually kind of hurt. I'm just here to party! All six item seeds. Fuck me up. Dark coin, mole bear claw, chocolate, fairy wall. Ooh, fairy walnut. I got a cobra bracelet? Whoa! I never got straight up equipment out of these before. Oh, yeah. I forgot that I have the rabbi endorment. Dude, hell yeah, give me more experience points. Oh, I'm actually wearing it! Oh, that's nice! Also, look, see Hawkeye? Four equipment slots. Duran? Five, because he can get a shield. Depending on how you play him. Hold on. Does this show up on him? Uh, if it does, I can't see it. It might be because he's got those gauntlets on. Dude, it gives him crazy good defense. His defense is thirty. Or is twenty-one now? I'm just gonna get the extra experience points to catch up. Also cancels poison, well, which is super again. cool. Whoop. Welcome. Rest till morning. <sighs> Fully clothed. How disappointing. <sighs> Sylphid Day. Save slot two, obviously. That looks pretty. I'm only gonna have two party members for the first boss. That's what I'm used to, bitch. Damn, they really like helped with the sense of scale of these places. I know this is a temple and all, but, um... Oh, okay. <laughs> huh. 
Hup! Please, accept the Goddess of Manor's blessings. Your Eminence, what do you know about the Choker of Death? How can I stop the curse? I need to save Jessica. Choker of Death? But that's a forbidden and ancient magic. How did this come to be? Here's the story. I am certain that Isabella is not what she seems. Thank you. Hawkeye, my apologies. But I do not know how to lift a curse so ancient and evil. Only the goddess of mana can do that. Only the mana goddess? That can't be. What am I supposed to do now? You're the priest of light, right? Tell me how to change my class. I need to be stronger now. Oh, you're just throwing that out there, huh? Impossible. There is no way you could switch classes right now. <laughs> you lack the experience necessary for such a feat. What? Wait, wow. I... They're just making the game mechanic like as part of the plot. Tell it's kind of neat. Manistones, correct? First, you must gain enough experience through battle. Then call upon a mana stone's power to switch to another class. Who's got time for that? Your Eminence, if I don't get stronger, I can't give that crimson jerk what's coming to him. Wait, I have something to say. Your Eminence, please listen. I have come from the Sanctuary of Mana to tell you that the mana tree is withering. Mana power grows weaker by the day. Withering, but without the mana tree, the seals on the mana stones will break. The Benevidons will be released into the world. The uh, what? Uh, come again? God beasts. You're acting like this doesn't affect you. You've been chosen by fairy. This means that you alone can retrieve the sword of mana from the sanctuary. Whoops. I've been what now? She didn't mention that. Hey, fairy, what's this about? I'm sorry. I didn't but consent. The mana in the world so depleted. A fairy can't leave the sanctuary for long without a host. If I hadn't found you, he wouldn't have made it. Yeah, okay. You're welcome and all that, but you're not welcome anymore. Go haunt the old man over there instead, huh? Would that I were able to bear your burdens. However, once a fairy finds a host, they are bound to them for their whole life. Only death can part them. Got it. Wait one second. I never agreed to this. I don't need a sort of mana or whatever. You want revenge on the person who killed your friend Eagle and to lift the curse on Jessica, right? The sword of mana could break any curse, and it can destroy Isabella. Hey, keep your fairy fingers out of my head. What is the sword of mana anyway? It's a sword, Hawkeye. The sword of mana is the embodiment of the ancient power of mana, guiding force of spirit. It is an alternate form of the golden wand used to create the world itself. Oh, I'll remember the that. One who holds the mana sword gains awesome power. The sword lies in the roots of the mana tree, waiting. Before the mana tree withers completely, must reclaim the sword and awaken the goddess of mana once more. She alone can bring peace to the realm and grant your wish. I could destroy Isabella for what she did to Eagle. <laughs> I'll do anything to save Jessica. 
don't know if you guys can hear it, but the piano's so, like where can I find this sanctuary playing like mana exactly? The original mana theme. I am so sorry, but with mana so depleted, I don't have enough power to open the portal to the sanctuary. Not by myself. Throughout the world are eight points of mana energy, mana stones, sealing away the fearsome Benevidon. If you activate the Mana Stones, the portal connecting our world to the Sanctuary of Mana should appear. Through that portal is the Sanctuary. However, you should know that the energy inside the eight Mana Stones was sealed on purpose as the Mana Goddess began her slumber. So we shouldn't fuck with it? So, what should I do? I'm gonna go fuck with it. In ages past, there once was an ancient spell used to control the energy from the Mana Stones and bend it to the user's will. However, countries refuse to allow each other any control of the spell and use of the Mana Stones. The war that followed caused unspeakable damage. It was nearly as destructive as the sealed Benevidons. The survivors cursed the magic to avoid future tragedy and forbade anyone from using oh. it. Now the life of any person who can go on so long that sleep mode turned on. Forfeit. There is no longer anyone alive who knows how to work this cursed spell. Guess that's it then. There may be one way. If we borrow the powers of the elemental spirits that reside near the Mana Stones instead, I can combine their powers with what remains of mine to open the portal for everyone. Splendid! This is a relief. If you wish to find a Mana Stone, I've heard many say that the Light Stone is in Cascade Cavern. Guarded by the elemental Lumina. It is the cavern you pass through in order to reach here. Neat! Take Fairy. With what remains of her power, she can help you find Lumina in the cavern. See if you may borrow his light powers. Okay. Answer me straight, Fairy. If I go along with you for this journey, will the Mana Goddess grant my wish? Certainly! You can become the world's strongest swordsman. Let's do this. All right. <laughs> then I'm in. Simple pleasures. The Priest of Light's Faith has granted you a new ability? Hit point boost. Sick. That's new. So I just equip extra hit points? Chain abilities can be used by all party members. Learn more abilities by locating tra training points and meeting people along your journey. You may learn chain abilities from quite unexpected acquaintances. Well. Uh, where do I go to ditch under training? Where is the equip? Moves. Costume. Duh. Strategy? Oh, right. Duh. It's right here. I'm dumb. Damn, so I could just straight up give him plus 30 hit points. I guess we don't really need break armor right now, so let's give him a fuck ton of hit points. Neat. 
Hello. I'm here to pray for my sick mother. <laughs> I'm gonna look around a bit, see if there's stuff. No running on temple grounds. I'll do what I want! Do not shout while on temple grounds. Stardust herb. Sprint, 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 sprint. Hello. Is there someone you're searching for? Sorry, didn't mean to slip oh, up. Sorry, I, oh, I guess you got nothing to say. Didn't mean to cut you in half. Sorry. Whoops. Bird. Look at bird. Look him. Hey, man. You just chilling here? <laughs> Isn't the view from here beautiful? Actually, yeah, that does look that looks pretty good. Ooh, treasure. Chocolate! I have so much food on me. Oh, I I put the 30 hit point skill on Duran. And it didn't, like, give him those 30 hit points. So right now he's technically missing 30 hit points. So now it just looks like he got super hurt from something. What are you doing? I was with my mom a second ago, but I got a little lost. And you shall stay lost forever. You can say that this lucra has been quite lucrative. Thing around. I'm playing the Switch version. It has like a little icon in the lower left, letting you know when sprint mode is activated or not. Kind of seems unnecessary, but all right. And a couple wishes. Okay. Yeah! Oh, someone left their money! Or item seed, even better. This sounds more like original Secret of Mana music than the Secret of Mana remake music was. Moon Exit, thanks for the Twitch Prime sub. So now I can go back and search for the whole elemental of light. Lumina. What's 
go to the bar. Oh, someone left their money in the bar. I would like to one drink, please. Damn. It says it's close till the evening. Let's sleep till the evening. No day drinking allowed? Damn it. I actually don't remember if there's anything at night at all. But I kind of want to see. Well, I'm going to drink with my good buddy Kevin. And the rest of the chat. Let's get Welcome. wasted. Who wants shots? Oh, you can skip that. Nice. Did I have the same team on SNES or switch things up? I've played with this team before, but my usual team was Hawk, Duran, Kevin. I brought in uh, Reese this time. Because I like her, and she has fun extra dialogue with Hawk in a scene. Shots, 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 shots. Oh, hell yeah. We're getting crunk up in here. Why the long faces come and make merry? All the priests are drinking. Why am I, what am I drinking? Uh, holy water, of course. Alcohol is forbidden to priests such as myself. Hell yeah, dude. I would like... How many shots we're getting? Shots of holy water, please. Stay a while, friends. <laughs> Yeah, the holy water is just vodka. Uh, you can't tell, but I definitely got drunk. We're all drunk now. Oh, oh more stuff shows up at night? Damn. There are rumors that the beastmen invaded Jad. Are they true? Oop. Yeah, we all accept that the holy water is just vodka, right? And we're just gonna walk past her. Oh. you were talking to Grandpa about. You are no simple adventurer. Since you have a quest of your own, I have a favor to ask. I gotta find Heath, and I need your help. Ugh. No can do, little lady. Woo woo! This journey is way too dangerous for a child. I can't promise you'll be safe. No, chat, no, don't talk like that. I swear to God. Okay. Don't worry. We'll find out what happened to Heath for you. Leave it to- Hey! Come on! I'm just worried about Heath! Please! No. I really can't come with you! No. Oh, fine! You are so stubborn! And mean! You- you- you meanie! Too bad. See you later. I don't care. I don't care. That's the last we'll ever see of her. He's dropping stuff. Next. Uh -huh. I hate to pick on such weak targets, but I like you can hear the uh, the like um, like old like monster exploding death sound effect from the original game. That's a nice touch. Come here. All right, clear away. 
Ow. Like that. Just exploding into skulls. A secret? A power coming from the waterfall. See that strange hole? Further up. I bet Lumina is in there. Oh, that's right. This would be float across using magic. You get him. I'll take care of this one guy. Ha! Like how the air strong attack does like a little bit of an AOE effect when you land. Love how easy it is to switch between characters, especially during combat. I'll take point and leave the rear to you. Anyone got a light? I mean, level five yet. Hmm. Medical herb. Hell yeah, I got some medical herbs in my right. Okay. Get this at the gnome. Thanks for resubbing. Keyboard controller. Playing on the Switch. Kind of curious about how hard this boss will be. talking about, right? How are we supposed to get over there? Magic. Oh, right. I forgot you can't fly. I think I can use the residual mana power in the waterfall to get you over there. Hmm. Let's give it a try. Magic. Normally you just like float across, but I guess you just teleport in this one. All right, sick. Is there a way to lock on the enemy? Yeah, you can. You just click right stick. Let's you lock on. I didn't like the lock on very much. Oh, he's got armor. Duran definitely shot a crosscut when he used it, so that's awesome. Okay, so some enemies can't just have defense. Whoop, hold on. Hell yeah. Uh oh, oh god. <laughs> Oh, 
big crit. <laughs> Excuse me. Duran leveled up. You guys are hiding treasure. <coughs> oh. Excuse me. Get caught in my throat. <coughs> oh dang. My potential feels limitless. There we go. I'm finally catching up to Duran. Only got one point. How do I want to build Hawkeye? Plus five luck is cool. Damage dealt by the targeting player. By enemy targeting players decreased by 5%. 10% chance of decreasing damage from an opponent by 50%. Whoa, if you increase Hawkeye's intelligence, he has a chance of just causing poison? Damn. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna hold on to it. Any major changes to the remake? Yeah, the whole level up and skill system is completely new. And there's no multiplayer. Dexterity is no longer a stat. I'm one step closer to becoming the strongest swordsman in the world. Watch out! A zom -zom. Oh, they look adorable in this one. Ah, he even does a little ghosty thing when they die. That's fun. Another cup of wishes. I'll just start selling those for money. Is that one chilling on a rock? Oh, many dudes. Oh, many dudes! Dodge! Oh! Ow. Anyone got a light? Defeating an opponent with a class strike? That's an experience bonus? Okay. Can you switch characters? Yeah, you can switch okay. on, whenever you okay. want. Leave it to me. And your AI of companions actually do way more in battle than you would think. <laughs> Have I tried putting the Japanese voices? Do I like it better? No, I ain't no weeb. Alright, here we go. Oh hell yeah! Best song in the game. This can't be the elemental. No, this isn't the elemental we're looking for. It's a giant monster. Oh, it has different hit points. Okay. So why do I feel mana uh. power coming off of it? What? How could a monster have mana power? It doesn't matter. Right? 
Holy Bolt Plus? That seems bad. Oh, he busted one of his eyes open. Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Get away! It's actually easier to fight now that you can dodge stuff. Crosscut! 149? Holy shit! in on your plight while you were fighting. Telepathy is great, huh? Just Can't say like that's... Fairy, we elementals need mana to live. Can't say that's what I imagined. I'll help however I can to make Lumina's sure voice we save be like. mana of the world. Lumina, where is the light stone? It's straight up from here, deep within the old ruins. But you can't exactly get there from here. Oh, no, 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 no. It's safe, though. For now, at least. It's so unstable. It seems like the Benevadon could be unsealed at any minute. We gotta get the rest of the elementals on board and open the portal to the sanctuary! Alright, well, guys like power, so... Sick. Huh? Look at that! A shortcut. That guy was actually pretty tough as a first boss in the original game. He seemed easier this time around, and I'm playing on hard, so, I don't know. Now that you can access Luminous Powers, you can use Light Elemental Magic by putting training points towards... What? You can actually train towards the elements? Okay. Or is that just for casters? That must just be for casters. That's crazy, though. Well, I have some strength for Duran. I got two points for Hawkeye. That's just max out his luck. No, I don't want Charlotte. We have Reese coming. <clears throat> well, yeah, depending on what class you make Duran, he can get uh, spells. Like, he can go straight up Paladin and get a bunch of healing spells. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm still gonna keep streaming, but I'm gonna end the recording for YouTube here so that the YouTube recording doesn't get too long. That way the, um, VODs aren't crazy long for everybody, but if you're watching this on YouTube, much appreciate. Don't forget to watch me live over at twitch.tv slash projared as we continue to play through the Trials of Mana remake. Later, YouTube. Thanks for watching the VOD. <laughs>